Hey, hey, everybody. I know you guys have been in the world of social media and you have saw everything that's popping off with Melody Cherie Rogers and Arianne Curry, a.k.a. Coleslaw, and Martel, a.k.a. Hotel Hope. I recorded this video probably 10 times. The reason why I consistently recorded it over is because when I say Melody's name, I'm so used to saying Melody Hope. But I refuse to disrespect her by calling her Melody Hope. I will correct it because she way better than, you know, to be called Melody Hope. The, the things that this man has put her through is just, it's just beyond me. Like, I can't even like, I just, this is just too much. So if you guys have been in the world of social media, you know that Ariane, aka Coleslaw, has been fighting and arguing with Melody Holt online. So let's talk about what occurred that, you know, made everything just spew out of control. Allegedly, Melody is saying that Ariane and Hotel, they going to jail. They going to jail. So Ariane was recorded saying that she was in the she was in possession of the sex tape with Melody and her then husband. And she pretty much confessed that they were conspiring to release that. Ma'am, that is a crime. So if you all have been following Melody, you saw that she made that video. You going to jail. You going to jail. So allegedly, that is what that's in response to. So apparently, Ariane is going back and forth, back and forth online because she mad. Well, Ariane, girl, you always mad. Since you were introduced to the world as a side chick, you were mad. You were mad because you couldn't be on Love and Huntsville, Love and Marriage Huntsville. You mad because you a side, she was a side chick. You're still a side chick and he not even married no more. So Ariane is always mad. You look real crazy out in these streets. How do you get in a full-fledged, online argument with some woman's husband that you were messing around with when she was married and you have all of these crazy things to say about this woman. It goes to show where you are mentally. A man will do anything and we know Martel is definitely a man that'll do anything. We watched him on the show. You can look at Martel and tell that he is a piece of trash. So you mean to tell me you are going to listen to what he says about his wife, ex-wife? So let's jump right in, guys. So I'm going to play a couple of video clips. Um, and this is Melody's response to Arion, And then we'll come back to discuss it. Um, so just sit back and let me get these videos up and going, and then we will come back and discuss the video. Give me a moment. We'll be right back. Y'all, yeah, hey, Shamir. If so, that's pretty. See, my cousin is on here. George, my other cousin, just came on here. What's up? What's up? I see all of these content pages. Caramel Real, Money Making Melody. Whew. I see y'all. Oh, God. Dang. Hey, Mama. Mama, uh, glad you're on here today, but you can go ahead and leave left. <laughs> Exit stage left for a minute. <laughs> see? Uh-uh. I should have snuck and got her phone, turned off notifications while I was down there. Hey, Mama, go on and log off this live. I'll call you in a minute. Um, business moving what's up so listen let me go ahead and say this really quickly um okay first off let me say i can say certainly that for a very long time a very long time i've been literally sitting over here minding my business not giving nobody no time of the day not like just paying people does 
mama said, okay, I'm getting off good. Thank you so I can speak freely. But you know, you got to have a certain level of respect for your mama. Okay? Huh. So, let me go ahead and say this real quick. Um, I have been choosing to take the high road and ignore all the little shady stuff and the little shady posts and all the little shady shit because my mama should be off by now okay um i've been choosing to be there but let me make something very clear okay and i'm saying this because i'm sure that the little fake profiles are watching anyway so you see me let me make something very clear my choosing to be professional to handle my business, to ignore you, does not negate the fact that I will whoop your ass. And I mean that with everything in me, period. Now you already know I've pulled up on you before, before. And let me say this to the people who are on the whole, like this ain't nothing about no man. Let me be very clear about that because I done got a couple of DMs like, this what he want, he want women fighting over him. This ain't got nothing to do with no man at all. I gave that up in 2020. This is 2023. I left him in 2020. Ain't been back since. So it has nothing to do with no man at all. I don't care about him. Don't want his attention. I don't need him. Don't want him. It has everything to do with, as a woman, why do you continuously Think that you're going to keep coming for me. Why do you think that? Why do you think that? Why do you think that? And any woman on here that's been in that position, I'm talking to you too. If you have been messing with somebody's husband and they give that man to your ass, take your ass on and live in Everland, Neverland, Everland, happily ever afterland. Go on and do your thing. Live your life. But to continuously, continuously try to keep coming at the once then wife that you was sleeping with her man, <laughs> her husband, that is whack, lame, and I'm not here for it. And listen, let me say this. I know some of y'all are like, but Mel, stay on your throne, you queen. And I'm still a queen. And I'm going to be queen when I finish doing what I got to do and say what I got to say. I'm going to be a queen after that, before that, during that, and after that. I've been posting business deals and business stuff in between the mess on my store for the last two, three days. That ain't going to stop. That's not stopping. But what I am saying, y'all, is people have to learn to leave well enough alone. Quit bothering people if they ain't bothering you. Don't bother folks who ain't bothering you. My auntie just came on here. Auntie, go on and get off this live. My favorite auntie just got on here. Go on now. Exit. Exit. Don't bother people that ain't bothering you. Period. And this is what I'm on right now. I don't care. I really don't. I don't care. I don't give a shit. It don't matter. It's I'm on what you on for real. It doesn't matter because I don't bother nobody. I sit over here, mind my business, handle my kids, all the little snippets. Okay, guys, what did you think? What did you think? I told you that she is snapping, okay? Melody is sick and tired of y'all with this bully and crap and, you know, coming against her. I just don't understand if she, if her husband continuously, he only needed to cheat one time. He cheated, she left him, and then she actually took him back. And not only is Martel, like, harassing her, he went and got his side chick. So that is the first video. Then after that video, there were a series of tweets and Instagram posts. And this is the next um, post that Melody posted. So I'm going to get that video up and loaded. Um, just sit back and I will be right back with that video. Just give me a moment. First of all, ain't nothing bad bodied over here. Let's be clear. Come with something deeper than that. Like, come with something better than that. Any, that's the first thing lames want to throw out is about somebody's body or about somebody's hair, all that surface shit. Come with something deeper. Let's talk about your morals or lack thereof. Let's talk about your integrity or lack thereof. 
Let's talk about that. Okay, let's talk about some stuff that actually has a little bit of substance. Okay. Secondly, girl, you're talking about I filed bankruptcy. Bankruptcy, yes, sweetie. After your boyfriend filed. After he filed. So I didn't want everything to fall on me, not because I couldn't take care of everything. So let's get the facts straight. But I'm sure you have still continued to listen to all the lies that he gave. You know what? I finally understand why you was able to be a side chick for five years because you dumb. That's why. I didn't know how slow you really were. But you've been calling me slow for years on Beyonce's internet right here. And I ain't said nothing. But now I understand how you've been able to be a side chick, how you was able to do that for five years. Because you really slow. And then he still ain't out with you. That is called slow. Get yourself some morals. Get yourself some integrity. Do yourself a heart check. And let me be clear. Where's your daughter? Because you said you having family day with y'all five kids. I got four with them. You got one and then another child. Now, how I, you can't count either. I already know you don't know the difference between here and here. H-E-A-R and H-E-R-E. -E. But you can't count either. So... Somebody said, please, for charges. Girl, y'all know I'm already handling all of that. And then for you to say you aren't talking about me, girl, you still got a whole video of me with my then husband. For what? What you got that for? For what? See, that's slow too, baby girl. Matter of fact, I'm going to be honest. If I was with a dude and he my man and he got a video of him with another woman and trying to show it to me, send it to me, anything me. I would be like, do you still want her? Can you stop talking about her? Why are you sending me this video of you and her? Like, that don't make you think that, like, slow. Slow. So, somebody said, Mel got time all week and this week. So, since you said you can't pull up today, just know. Listen. Hey guys, and that is pretty much it. I have showed you both videos um, of Mel Melody Cherie Rogers. You see, I had to do that slow because I cannot call her Hope. And Ariane Curry, AKA Coleslaw. Let me know what you think in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I will see y'all in the next video. Don't forget to enjoy your holiday, and I will see you in the next one. Talk to you later.